First at 6.30, dragged in the street. A man on a scooter is in the hospital following a hit and run. Police say that victim was riding his scooter on US-1 and Southwest 128th Street in Pinecrest this morning when a vehicle struck him, dragged him. A sharp-eyed Good Samaritan helped state troopers nab him. CBS 4's Donna Rapato is live at Kendall Regional Medical Center where that victim is recovering tonight. Donna? That's right, Natalia. That man is here at Kendall Regional. We are told he's in critical condition, and we just spoke to the Florida Highway Patrol and got an update. Let's fill you in on that. Let's show you this picture here. This is the suspected hit and run driver. His name is Willie Thornton. He's 38 years old, and as you mentioned, Natalia, FHP troopers were able to catch him shortly after this accident due to a good Samaritan. Sunday morning was just getting started when a vehicle hit this scooter and its driver, possibly dragging them both along US-1 at Southwest 128th Street in Pinecrest. You can see the impact shredded the scooter, barely anything left of it. And the driver was rushed to Kendall Regional by air rescue. Back on US-1, Florida Highway Patrol found the demolished scooter at a gas station on Southwest 184th Street, miles from where it was first hit. That's crazy. Honestly, she was one. Friday night, no, Saturday night, actually. Say that again? Saturday night, so drunk people everywhere. FHP has not confirmed alcohol was a factor, but troopers spent the morning processing several scenes, including this one here, where they photographed this blue SUV with front end damage. Moments later, they were at an apartment complex on Southwest 268th Street in Southwest Miami Dade, arresting this man. It's pretty crazy. I didn't expect that to come in the morning. It's kind of crazy how they blocked the road. Usually take this road to get here, and it looked pretty intense. They looked pretty. The officers' faces, you could tell there was something wrong, uh, you know. And again, 38-year-old Willie Thornton now in jail. The suspected hit-and-run driver who you saw being arrested there in that piece. He is charged with leaving the scene of an accident with serious bodily injury. That is the most serious crime that he's charged with, a second-degree felony. And again, the driver of the scooter here at Kendall Regional, we're told in critical condition. We're live at Kendall Regional, Donna Rapato, CBS 4 News.